Hello, I will talk about Einstein's famous equation E equals mc square. E is energy, m is mass, and the c is the speed of light that is 300,000 kilometers per second. The definition of uh, mass is uh, how much uh, a body attracts other things to it according uh, to its uh, gravity. The second uh, definition of mass is uh, how much the body resists uh, acceleration. Uh, the difference between uh, nuclear energy and other forms of energy is uh, when you burn uh, wood in the fireplace to, cre to create uh, heat, the final product uh, is heat energy and uh, charred wood. Uh, when fuel is used uh, to drive a car, for example, the final product is kinetic energy that makes uh, the car travel and uh, gas. That is uh, the liquid uh, gasoline turned uh, into gas, which was emitted from the car. On the other end, when you convert mass into nuclear energy, the mass disappears completely, so there are no byproducts that remain, like in burning wood or like in using gasoline. And, uh, and that's actually the why nuclear energy is uh, so huge because that uh, the mass disappears completely and uh, becomes all energy. Um, the three things uh, that we can uh, derive uh, from the equation is that uh, uh, the first uh, conclusion is that uh, even uh, masses at rest have energy inherent in them. So if uh, you have a ball uh, on the floor that is not uh, moving, uh, the ball has energy inherent uh, to it. The second uh, conclusion from the question is that uh, you can uh, convert uh, mass to pure energy. For example, from uh, one kilogram of mass, uh, you can get uh, tremendous energy that is equal to 21 million tons of uh, TNT. Um, the third uh, conclusion from the equation is that uh, you can uh, create mass from uh, pure energy out of nothing. Okay, thank you very much.